Hello, my name's Linda. I'm a UK independent stamping up demonstrator, and today I'm making two cards. Um, they're going to be four by four cards, and I'm using the new stamp set, Snailed It. This will be available in January 2021, and this is just a sneak preview. It's a really cool set. I really love it. And it comes with dies, so you get dies that cut out all of the images here, not these ones but obviously you can put the hello in the little speech bubble there you get some mushrooms and this little mini envelope which is really cute I'm not going to be using that today but I will be using it um, on another project soon so let's just get started I am going to be using the dies today I'm going to start with a little bit of stamping so I've got my stamp radis out today and I've put um, three images I'm just going to ink these up. My Stamparatus has been packed away. If you watch any of my videos, you know I have recently moved. And so towards the end of moving, I had to pack lots of stuff away. And I still haven't unpacked everything yet. I still There's still plenty of things I cannot find. So the beauty of the Stamparatus is that you can re-ink and re-stamp if you've not got a great image the first time round. Okay, so I'm reasonably happy with that. And these are the images, and I am actually gonna color these in using the blenders, um, so we don't have to watch. I've already done this before, so I've colored these ones in. Like right, so. Um, I've used Poppy Parade, Granny Apple Green, uh, Daffodil Delight, Bermuda Bay, um, and Flirty Flamingo on these ones. I'm going to be putting um, two images on one card and one image on the other card so let's put these cards together. I'm using um, thick Whisper White cardstock and this is 8 inches by 4 inches. Now the Whisper White cardstock is actually um, going to be changed to basic white because there's been a problem with the paper mill where the Whisper White was made. And I think due to Covid it's actually shut down so um, that we've had to find somewhere else, Stampin' Up! had to find somewhere else. So at the moment I'm using Whisper White still and I'm scoring that at four inches and that's obviously going to make a four by four card. I'm doing the same with the other one. Nice and simple. And I've also cut out some Whisper White and I've cut this at three and three quarters by three, three. so a square, and it's going to go on the front of our cards, right? So, so let's do a tiny bit more stamping. I'm going to be using a sentiment from Well Said. Um, there are sentiments on the Snailed It, but I actually want um, a thank you card on one of mine, so I'm just going to be taking thanks from here. And I'm just going to stamp this at the bottom of one of the um, layers. go. Next I have both of my um, layers ready and I've got my dies. So this die is the one for um, the mushroom. I'm going to put that on the card that I've not stamped on. And then the die for the um, large snail I'm going to put on here. So I want to line my dies up so they're in the center of my card or of my card layer and then I'm going to run these through my big shop. So just die cut holes from the cards. Well, there we go. Just going to bring my card bases in and obviously these are going to go on top of the cards like so. So what we want to do without sticking put your layer where you want it on the top of the card. So I want that one there. When you're happy where you have your layer, and you have it, make sure it is straight as you can get it. And then I'm going to put some glue in the gap. Try not to put too much. It's a bit tricky actually because this is a brand new glue. It's coming out nice and fast. And then we're going to put our die cut image into the gap, like so. 
then we can take this off and then on the back we're going to put some dimensionals I'm going to do the same with this one some glue in the hole without moving the top layer put your image in Okay, and then we're going to flip that over and put some dimensionals on the back there as well. And then the tricky bit is putting this back over. So you want to line it up. So I'm just hovering here with your image, but make sure it's also straight. And there we go. Do the same with this one. And then on this one, I have my little snail, and I'm going to, I've popped him up on dimensionals as well. And I'm going to have him sort of sliding past. And there we go, two um, cute four by four cards. Uh, I'm going to be using these as, I'm going to use both of these as thank you cards for my boys to send out after Christmas. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, if you're in, interested in this stamp set and dies, they are available, I think it's from the 5th of January. The mini catalogue uh, goes live so you can start um, purchasing from it. If you don't have a catalogue and you don't already have a UK demonstrator and you'd like one, please get in touch and um, I can send out some catalogues to you. Thanks for watching. Bye.